So, the next part of the discussion here is that is valency concept. When you say valency, what do you mean by valency? I will simply say valency is nothing but combining capacity of element. Bluntly we can use only one single meaning for valency that is number of that is the combining capacity of an element is simply called as valency. Then what do you mean by valency electrons? If you go for valence electrons, number of electrons present in outermost shell shell or orbit of atom is are called valence electrons. Now, go for types of valences. If you go for valency types, valency valency types if you take it is of two types one is electrovalency electrovalency and the one is covalency electrovalency and covalency if you go for electrovalency electrovalency is obtained it, it can be obtained in two methods electrovalency can be obtained by loss of electron of atom electrovalency can be obtained and also sometimes gain of electron of atom it can be acquired so whatever whatever may be the case the electrovalency is of both the types it can the valency which is obtained by a species either because of the loss of electron of an atom or sometimes it is gain of electron of an atom if you go for covalency is nothing but number of bond pair electrons shared by an atom in a molecule number of bond pair number of bond pair electrons number of bond pair electrons shared by an atom in a molecule is simply nothing but covalency so one more shortcut if you want to calculate the valency go for valency calculation of if you are going for the calculation of valency we can use two formulas you can use one is elements elements from 1a to up to 1a up to that is 4a 4a means 14 group 1a means it is alkali metals one a means it is alkali metals so from alkali metals to 14 group that is carbon family carbon family you can directly use the formula valency is equal to valency v is equal to its group number valency is equal to group number for example for example for 1a group for 1a group you take sodium potassium and rubidium what is its valency means i can simply say 1 why it is 1 because these are all metals so they lose electrons they can lose only one electrons when they are going to lose one electron its valency is 1 go for for example if you are going for 14th group what is the valency of this is example 1 example 2 what is the valency valency of 4th year group 4th year group that is carbon family
carbon family. So, again valency is equal to valency of carbon family is equal to 4 that is because if you take carbon, silicon, germanium, tin and lead these are all the elements which are belonging to the carbon family 14 group. So, in all these elements you find that the number of valence electrons are 4. So, its valence is equal to 4. Similarly, if you go to the valency that is if you are going to the valency that is valency of elements from 3rd A that is 13th group 3rd A 13th group to that is 13th group to 8th A group 8th A that is 18th group 18th group we can use the formula that is valency V is equal to 8 minus the group number. So, take the 15th group, 15th group is 5A, 5A is nitrogen family, nitrogen family. So, here you can take elements nitrogen, phosphorus, arsenic, antimony and bismuth. Go for 16th group, 60th group, oxygen family, oxygen family, oxygen, sulphur, selenium, tellurium, polonium. Similarly, go for 17th group, 7th A, that is halogens, halogens can take fluorine, chlorine, bromine, iodine and astatine. Go for 18th group, 8th A group noble gases, so helium, neon, argon, krypton, xenon and radon. Bismuth, V i bismuth, P o polonium, A t astatin, R n radon, all these are radioactive element, all these are radioactive elements. So, you, they need not be under our discussion. So, we let us ignore all the radioactive elements. But suppose if I am underlining uh, phosphorus, I am underlining sulphur, I am underlining chlorine and I am underlining neon. Calculate the valency, the question goes like this. Calculate the valency question, calculate the valency of underlined elements. Calculate the valency of underlined elements. So, first one is phosphorus. So, you know that phosphorus belongs to 50th group. So, valency, I will put it like this V of P means valency of phosphorus is equal to 8 minus phosphorus group number is 5. So, therefore, 8 minus 5 is equal to 3. So, therefore, valency of phosphorus is 3. Valency of sulphur, yes, is equal to 8 minus 6 which is equal to 2. So, therefore, valency of sulphur is 2. Similarly, valency of chlorine, if you take C L which is equal to 8 minus the group number of chlorine is 7 halogens which is equal to 1. So, valency of <coughs> neon, if you take 8 minus the group number 8 which is equal to 0. So, therefore, the valency of phosphorus is 3, valency of sulphur is 2, valency of chlorine is 1 and valency of neon is 0 respectively. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on CBSE syllabus.